All right, guys, thank you for joining, and we're getting ready to do the Thanos arm workout. Now, for those of you who don't follow comics or have any clue what I'm talking about, that's okay. Just do the workout, and your arms are going to blow up. Now, for those of you who love comics, we are going to do six exercises, each exercise representing an infinity gem, and you are going to love it. So if, you're, if you want your arms to go from this to this, Stay tuned. All right, guys. So the first infinity gem I'm going to access is the mind gem. That allows me to get inside your head and figure out what your thoughts are and your dreams and all that stuff. And I know since you're watching this video, you're dreaming about having big arms. So we're going to channel that gem and we're going to do 20 ones. Now, most people do 21s in a little different order than I do. So watch and see if you can see how different my order is compared to the way you normally see 21s done. So if you can tell how I'm doing these different compared to how they're traditionally done, comment below. See if you want to see if you're picking up what I'm doing different. Four sets. Ah. Oh. All right. So the second infinity gem we're going to tap into is the power gem. The power gem gives you access to superhuman strength. So we're going to move on to a tricep exercise. We're going to flip flop, bicep, tricep, bicep, tricep. But this is our first tricep exercise. We're using an assisted chin dip station, and we're doing push downs. Make a triangle with your hands. I love these because look at the stretch. We're going to do sets of eight. I like these because your chest can help you too, so you can generate more power. It's not an isolation exercise. You can use your chest, your shoulders, your tries. But these absolutely crush your triceps. So we're gonna do sets of eight here. Okay, this is our fourth set. Again, we're doing around eight reps. The goal is to use a lot of weight, but stretch your tricep and squeeze it. So big weight, big stretch, and big squeeze. Now we're going to use the power of the time gym. We're going to go back to the 60s where Larry Scott, he did this exercise they call Scott curls or preacher curls. We're going to do that, but with a little bit of a twist on it. Watch my form and see how it's a little bit different.
All right, so we're doing four sets here. Every set pretty much is a failure, right around eight or nine reps. All right, now we're gonna call upon the power of the Space Gym. The Space Gym allows you to be in two places at once. So we're gonna do a bicep and tricep exercise at the same time. All right, so you notice we're doing uh, a tricep kickback. I'm standing pretty far away. That's allowing me to get a good stretch. And notice I'm pinning, pinning my elbow against my side. And then I'm just doing a kind of a rope hammer curl. And I'm keeping my hands together, I'm kind of pushing my hands together. So here we go. <clears throat> All right, guys, now we're going to use the power of the soul gym. The soul gym is pretty cool because it allows you to suck the soul out of somebody. So what I want you guys all to do is channel the soul gym at Fouad Abiyad. I want you to suck Fouad's soul right out of him so he can get some of his triceps. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to get some of Fouad's soul in us so we can get some of his triceps. So what I love about using a kettlebell on these is you can get lower and get a better stretch. If you're using a dumbbell, you can literally knock yourself out. So if you can, try these with a kettlebell. Really good stretch. And I want you to do higher reps, up around 15 reps to set on these. This is our fourth set. guys now we're going to use the power of the reality gym the reality gym allows you to break scientific law scientific law says you can't use an exercise to increase the peak when your bicep you just can't do it your genetic shape is your genetic shape but we're going to violate that with the reality gym so we're going to use an exercise that increases our peak <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. All right, 
So we're getting ready to do our fourth set here. You gotta tilt back. Tilt your torso back, curl, but then flex your shoulder. So you get a little bit more contraction. So curl and, and flex your shoulder joint. Four sets of failure. All right, guys, so that's it. That's the Thanos arm workout. We used every single Infinity Gym in the book. That means you should have some omnipotent gains after doing that workout. Thanks for watching.